what, what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Remember Jeremy Meeks, the ex-felon who rose to fame back in 2014 after a mugshot upon his arrest for being a felon in possession of a firearm and grand theft went viral because some women and even some men were tripping about his looks, getting all excited and stuff? Well, dude has done pretty well for himself. In 2016, he began a surprisingly flourishing career in modeling. Dude took off. He's highly sought after. Then in 2017, he started dating an heiress, a billionaire heiress by the name of Chloe Green, and now they're expecting a baby. Some people are saying, oh, Jeremy has hit the jackpot. But quite a few people are quite frankly, pissed off about him marrying this chick, like getting hooking up with this chick. Some people are saying that he hooked up with her strictly to get to the money. Well, I'm not buying that, because like I said, dude was getting money already with his modeling. Now, he's not getting the kind of no billionaire money. But when you're getting that kind of money, man, love is a funny thing. And if you can take care of yourself and live the highlight. You can go where you want to go, do what you want to do, and have equal amount of access to women just like he had access to her. Most men are just not going to just put up with something like that if they don't want to do it. They're not going to just be in a relationship for the money hell. A lot of times women won't even do it. That's why you see a lot of times when women are with cats that got a lot of money, if they ain't got nothing and they hook up with a dude that got a lot of money, they ain't going to be together with them long. But you can guarantee that when they have money, when they have their own money, they ain't putting up with none of that, man. Women ain't got to have a fraction of a billionaire money. But if she can take care of her own and live the kind of life she want to live very, very comfortably, she going to get the kind of man she want to be with. That's just what it is, because I'm going to tell you something. A lot of people don't understand this, but I, I, know, I know a number of women who have walked out on billionaires like, and didn't get billions when they walked off either. I know a chick, I used to date this chick who walked off on a millionaire with nothing, like didn't want nothing from him, just walked off. Didn't ask for nothing. So they're out there, maybe few and far between, but yeah, they're out there. Now, the reason why I'm covering this story is because a lot of people, it seems to me, are employing a double standard here. Like, it's quite natural for women to hook up with rich men and nobody say anything about it. That's, that's standard, right? But now that a man has hooked up with a billionaire woman, it's a problem. But I see another level of this also. I've been reading stuff in the media. The media, cold-hearted, man. The media is really going in on him about being a felon. Uh, I didn't catch the I didn't catch uh, the outlet that put this out, but one of them said, "This I'm gonna read it for you. This is what they said. Damn, I wish I could remember who said it. Uh, I just kind of like grabbed the quote, but I, I wish I could remember who said which one of those outlets said this. But anyway, this is what they said." While Meeks technically has a biological son and two stepsons with Melissa, that's his former wife, uh, girlfriend or baby mama, this will be his first child with Green and our first opportunity to gawk at photos of Meeks cradling a non-felon baby. 
Who writes shit like that? This will be our first opportunity to gawk at him cradling a non-felon baby. That's some cold-hearted shit, man. That's some straight-up hating going on, right? They're comparing due to uh, K. Fed, Britney Spears' old old uh, old husband. Um, I don't know. Dude had his own. K. 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 Fed didn't have no bread. You know, dude. Dude was doing all right before he met old girl. So, and and he already had some fame. K. K. Fed came up strictly off of Britney, as far as I know. Uh, I didn't know him to have any type of celebrity before that. But I guess at the end of the day, what's good for the goose is good for the gander. So I ain't mad at old dude. Uh, hey, man, live your life, man. Because at the end of the day, you ain't got nobody but yourself and those who really love you. But I want to know what y'all think. Is it a double standard? And if so, are you cool with that double standard? I mean, we are in the age of equality. Women are saying they want equality. We want equality. We want equality. They want to do everything, but well, almost everything that men want to do. And are we there yet? Is it cool for men to finally hook up with women for a financial come up? Like women has traditionally done, right? Are we that? I want to get back to the hate. I just think it's a whole lot of hating going on. So, and I love attacking haters. So that's why I'm gonna end it. I'm gonna end this video on a good note. Jeremy, Chloe. Shake the haters off. You make a good couple. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.